Bye, boy. Queen Robert, 049. I'm sorry, thank you. You should be at 1800 feet back to it. Command center. This is Captain Storm. Adios. Copy this. Our heading is to Red Dragon. I repeat, Red Dragon. I know this is a dangerous place to be, but we will do as our country has asked of us. I have my orders. And so do you. Over and out. Yeah, like some old child, Storm, you're never satisfied. I'm not going to repeat myself, Storm. We are not going to go on this over you and ain't over. We are not here. Storm, I've been given Pacific orders. We are not here to occupy this land. Big sissy. And we will follow my Pacifics, as I have been given orders. Is that clear? Do you understand? We are not here to occupy this land. Look at your behavior and check, soldier. Their saints are called. Noise your director. It's my show. And I want to let you know something. You're going to do it your order. You we really must reach our desire goals and return home. The end of men won't waste military resources. On foolish Captain Storm, sir. You damn well better not, soldier. Now listen up here. The enemy is an ex-marine. Sergeant Bishop. He has appointed himself leader in the village of the Prime Russia. We're sending you in, Commander. You're gonna have to make him stand down. He has forgotten his teaching, soldier, and his loyalty to the United States of America. He has taken hold of this infrastructure of albino and this equipment and has sacrificed the whole of this operation for his own act. Now we're sending you in, Commander. His ambitions and We're gonna have to make him stand down. Look at your behavior and check, soldier. Their saints are called. Noise your director. You're going to do it your order. Captain Storm, sir. You have your mission objective, Commander Chilton. You're dismissed. East 
do it own. We have to get results. This is war. And war certainly exists. Alongside death. barricade up front. We're gonna have to take that out and secure this bridge. The help our supply lines and our boys in back. Before we're done. Sergeant Bishop really messed things up here. Believe all of that. 
We're soldiers. Huh? We're soldiers, stone wall. But Commander, I believe we've been indoctrinated to believe all of that. That's what I believe, Commander. Stone Don't walls you? Are so we've always known. I believe, that's what I believe, Commander. Don't you? I've always. Not me. Not me. I've always known. We've been indoctrinated to believe all of that. Somehow I've always known. I've always known. But Commander. Nothing here but this mission. The fault. Let it go, Stony. The commander ain't in the mood for your philosophy today. Let's go. I hate to bother you with these reports. Sir, I have to disturb reports have anything. There are command moves in the region. And their commander is Blade. Thank you. I'm gonna keep a watch for a while, old Blade. He's sneaky. Yes, okay. He's one of the best. But so are we, and we are in superior form. Yes, it's known that Blay took in that fuck many battles. We're more than ready for Blay Tilton and his daring the Magno. Yes. Such in a box. Such in the box, sir. We're more than ready for Blay Tilton and his daring the Magno. Why are you so loyal? So good. And now that you're here, let us do it. Bishop! Sergeant Bishop! You might as well come on out! You got nowhere to run! Let us play hero. Come on. Give it up, Sergeant Bishop! You're gonna cost your men their lives! That's all you're gonna do! Casualties are acceptable in war. Softness is not for us. That's no reason that your blood is still today. Who are you kidding? Late. Give up. The main thing is Take it easy, are ya? And if you can't handle me at my worst, you don't stand a chance against me at my best. Soldiers, Blade, and we are not afraid of death. We are soldiers, Blade. We have total discipline. We always wanted to try to be the one, Blade, the hero of the crew. Oh, oh, Sergeant Bishop! We have total discipline. Sergeant Bishop, stand down! Sergeant Bishop, I'm gonna hurt you. Sergeant Bishop! Sergeant Bishop, stand down! Sergeant Bishop, I want to use this.
Are we dealing with the actions of a rogue element? Well, I see them. More like a military element. Clearly, their actions are very political. Well, what do we have here, soldier? A nation? A single force? An act of a potential war? Give us some clearance, soldier. Think of them as a small group. A socialist, an industrialist, then there has been that I shoot up this powerful company, LSE, the logic system's evolution, that's created the program platform called Platonic Logic. Central Command's official mission, where Captain Storm had me on, led me to those who dare commit treason against our great nation. Military officers and industrialists were planning to muzzle something out of that down SR-71 Blackbird. And Calzone, an ex-defense contractor, who had won support through political elite groups, was one of them. His patriotism had turned to extremism, and it was fanatical. His policies and appeals for power had made him become a dangerous man. His voice was controversial, and somebody ordered him to be done away with
warehouse is quite big here. Mm, what? I know I heard something around here. What's some rusty nail tube that will knock fire from you? I'm not no Jolly Rancher. I'll take you down. You better ask somebody. And the Blake Tooth you dealing with here. I know goddamn well I heard something. I'm going around here. It's probably some old rusty nail. They better watch out. I'm not no easy Jolly Rancher, I can tell you that. I'm the Blake Tooth you dealing with here. Mr. Carzone. Glad to finally meet you, Mr. Carzone. Carzone? I'm not Carzone, Mr. Mr. Allen Gunn. One of them who commits treason? Treason? Then who the hell are you? I'm Commander Tilton of the Dern Commandos, Mr. Allen Gunn. Then you are being used, Commander. He's known about you already. He's put you up to this, to find me. No one's put me up to anything, Mr. Allen Gunn. Who knows about me? Who are you talking about? The one who commits treason, Commander. Major Tyrese. How do you know that, Mr. Allen Gunn? You're just a civilian. You're accusing a highly decorated military officer of treason. Commander. The Major is after a new weapon system that's inside the SR-71 Blackbird. He's put together the weapon defense contractors to find us the Glustor 105 weapon system. Major the Glustor 105? What kind of Major. pipeline story are you trying the to The Major is me, after a new Allen weapon Gun. system. It's no story. Furthermore, why should I believe you? He's already the had a secret base across the globe under his control. It is the dark base it is called. He took down the Blackbird. His intelligence came straight out of this dark base, Commander. They're not here to help me, Commander. They are here to get rid of me because I know too much. Commander! Commander! No! 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 You must be stopped, Gilly! You must be stopped, Gilly! Anyone, get help. Give it up, Command. You cannot win. Here. Commander, you cannot stop the forces of the door! We have chosen a better path, Commander. This is not the path for you. For we are the Dark Wizards, sir. And we are here to change everything. And you cannot stop us. You cannot stop us, Commander. Don't let him try. Allen Gun belongs to the Dark And you. And your society! Oh, 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 oh,
Night Wizards. We must leave. We've already achieved what we have come for. will give us the Pentagon briefing papers on the bus to 105. This is going to be the finish of you, Mr. Dicker. You and Mr. Major Tyree. Nobody needs to know about all that, Mr. Allen. The bus to 105 is a black ops operation. That can open up a whole other can of worms. I have found out about you, did you? You and Major Tyrese. You want that logic system. You want to build your military empire. Duh. Everyone's going to know about you. I'm going to tell it all. Ooh, that's not your business, Mr. Allen. Leave well enough alone. I'll just tell me. I can find the Pentagon briefing papers. I'm the Blast War 105! Go to hell, Denton. You know, you and Major Tyrese can just go to hell! Oh, if you're not careful with yourself, Mr. Allen, that's where you're about to go. Maybe even a little further. Hey, Denton. Someone is falling. Let's put some cars in distance between us and him. Oh, this guy. You see how bad he wants it. Looks like this military man has learned something in boot camp. Get back up ready. I want him dead. Okay, fellas. I want back up ready. Call him. Now. Well, well, you know something? I'm getting real tired of this military man.
us all the room done now. Ain't it? Commander Tobin. I don't know what you're talking about, mister. But you're barking at the wrong one. I found out about this man. His name is Denton. That was the first thing I found out. The second was Denton liked to kill. Him. I've seen a little blood from time to time myself. But not like this guy. much Suggest you get that story you were telling me in order. It seems to have some strength to it. He's trying to go in and extract the glove for 105 himself. This terrain is not the place of Captain Sir. Commander, you will be extremely limited here. Your team must find the SR-71 back side before Major Time is done. And once you come in contact with the Major, make him stand down. That's an order. Yes, sir, Captain Storm. Yes, sir. Captain, yes, sir. Alan Gunn said that the platonic logic system which governs the Gustav 105 and 109. Is that correct, sir? Correct. Alan Gunn's engine has given us a clear view on what this Gustav system will do, Commander. And Commander Harris, you'll be finding and taking down the Gustor 105. That's it. Commander? Commander? Looks like we're in Jordan Forces. Nothing we ain't used to by now, Commander Harris. By the way, how's your soldier? We're ready. We're so ready, we don't even need you and your soldiers. Commander? I mean, really? 
Take a moment and reconsider your direction. I see you have no intent on leaving, do you, Commander? Well then, welcome, Commander. Welcome. You have returned. If I could finish, but you have begun. You just get out of the way, mister. This ain't got nothing to do with you. Well, well, Commander. We are all part of some kind of war. Wars that are started long ago. Like us. The wizards. You. And us. Are part of a greater whole. Our cause is written in our genes, Commander. And we must obey them. Don't we, Commander? I'm warning you, mister. Get out of the way. Don't be a fool, man. Now put down that gun. And take that weapon. You finished my wizards. Let's see if you can repeat the action upon me. The Grand Master. Ugh! <sighs> 
Commander, is that enough blood dipping for you? Shut up, Stonewall! I'll tell you when to dip blood in. Stonewall! Yes, Commander. Thanks for saving my life, Stonewall. Yes, Commander. You did good, son. Yes, sir. You did good. All right, men. Men? Let's clean up this mess. Okay, guys. You heard the commander. Let's get you. You did good, son. Let's go. Let's move it down. 